Welcome, massive. I'm Mzeba. Welcome or welcome back to my channel where I share with you what I do to live naturally on a budget. Now, in this video, you have seen the title. I'm going to be sharing on seven things I wish I knew when I just started experience hair loss. Now, guys, I'm sharing this information, hoping that somebody will find it useful. I'm not remorseful in any way. I've accepted and appreciated this journey it has not been the best thing but i've come to terms with it and so i really am learning from the experience and i'm happy to share whatever information i have with you now the first thing i wish i did i wish i'd done research now i was not a research based person at the time but i have grown to become somebody who's research oriented and so i wish i'd gone out and researched about the types of hair losses the causes and so on and that way i would i think i would have been able to tackle the problem head on instead of having to make so many mistakes before i actually learned now the second thing is i wish i had not got a perm or chemical treatments no i say that because i think what happened is that the perm you know when you cream your hair or you or you treat it chemically i was also uh, using texturizers it kind of scarred the scalp sometimes or it burns the scalp and so i believe that that helped to damage some of my follicles so that is one of the things that i wish i had known then the next thing i wish i had known that my diet was so important to me having hair right and i also wish i had known based on the diet that um I should have been using anti-inflammatory foods so that is number three number four using organic products when I just started losing my hair organic products never come across my mind and so what I did I went out and I said this in one of my videos already I went out and I bought so many products and so if I would known that just the things in my environment could have been useful in helping to restore my hair i would not have wasted so much money on products that promised that they would restore your hair and they just did not deliver on that promise so that guys if you are experiencing hair loss if you just started please ensure you do your research so that you don't have to waste your money on buying products now vitamin e oil number five when i visited my hairdresser um to get my perm and she saw the challenge she recommended that I use vitamin E oil on my scalp now that was a mistake that caused me a major setback I started losing more of the hair when I started putting the vitamin E oil directly on my scalp so that is number five number six shea butter guys I visited the US uh, one year and I saw these products dirt cheap so i'm gonna say all right let me go out and get myself some shea butter because i hear that shea butter is good for the hair and for the scalp and for hair growth and so i was just plastering the butter on my scalp and guys again another mistake you know see how much mistake i make another mistake the hair start tear out again so please guys no butters on your scalp and seven and final I have more guys but I'm just keeping this brief but seven and final I wish I'd known that massages or scalp massages were so important in helping to restore the hair so as I said I'm just sharing this information I am uh, hoping that somebody else who has just started um, experiencing hair loss will find it useful and if you're already gone through all of this that I've been through I am testimony that your hair can be restored so there is hope for you now that's all i will share in this video thank you for watching and please if you found my content interesting or if you have been finding my content interesting go ahead subscribe to the channel and also click the like button thank you for watching see you in the next video bye